Oh, look at this. This is the featured image that we created. As you can see, it's loading and it has the parallax effect. We have the explore more. Wow, look at this. We have the mission, quite the ingredients. This is really a stunning website right here and it's all working. Look at that. Hello guys, so in this video, I would like to show you another tactic you can use to improve the design of your WordPress layout. So here, we will be using Claude and DeepSeek 3.1. Now, the first step that we will be doing is to ask Claude to improve our prompt that we always use. So this prompt right here, that we provide any LLM to create as instant WordPress team for our blog. I asked Claude to suggest a modern layout apart from the traditional card layout for WordPress. And as you can see here, it provided us several suggestions right here that we can use instead of the usual card layout. So you can see we've got a bunch of layout right here. Now the next step is we will ask Claude to, based on the suggestion, update our custom prompt, which is right here based on the provided modern layout, right? Just like on um, magazine style layouts, interactive tab, modular block layouts, bento grid, layout so we will ask Claude to apply that to our current team instruction or current prompt instruction which Claude provided right here so as you can see it changed our usual card layout to bento grid masonry layouts asymmetrical design so we should see this now when we apply this as our team for our new blood now what we do is copy this and here let's open a blank notepad paste it right there so this should have all our modern layout instruction to design our WordPress team. And in this example, we will be using this DeepSeek 3.1, the newest version of DeepSeek, to create the WordPress team that we instructed Claude to update. All right. So here, you just need to copy this, copy the new model right here. I'm going to use Open Router. Now we will set up a local WordPress so that we can write code and easily create our team. So after the team is created, you'll be able to upload that to your server. So we're going to add a new site right here. I'm using local WP. So if you want to download this and let's just click on continue. So name our site right here. So we will be using this niche right here. So as you can see, we have the vegan steak right here and we will be using these keywords to create some sample articles so that we can see our layout. Now going back here, so we will name this as vegan steak and click on continue, click on continue. So once your local WordPress is created, just click this one click admin. So title that and let's head over to VS Code right here. Now it will open up this WordPress files. And what we're going to do, let's head over to Klein. If you don't have this, just install this from the extensions right here. Just search Klein right there. And make sure you select the correct version from Open Router, which is the DeepSeek 3.1. So I copied that earlier. So I'm going to paste that right there so it won't cost much it's just 0 0.20 per million input and 0 0.80 per million output token so i don't think this will cost more than one dollar for us to vibe code so now let's copy this but first let me just populate the configuration variables right here the folder name will be this one dipsy 3.1 team the site title will be vegan steak and the team name let's have it as dipsy 3.1 vegan steak so this should have all the new layout that Claude provided for us modern layout instead of the traditional card layout. So let's see if it's going to work. I'm going to copy this and head back to Klein. Let's paste this right here. So we're using DeepSeek 3.1 and let's start white coding this. So as you can see, it's got the context of 163.8. So let's wait for a few minutes. But while we're waiting for DeepSeek 3.1 to complete our WordPress team, what I'm going to do is prepare the articles that we're going to add in our new WordPress so that we can see the post section. So I'm just going to copy some sample pick right here from people also ask section in Google. I'm just going to copy this. I'll just head over to article AI generator to quickly create my articles. So if you are going to pro create a bunch of articles for your new website and you want to make your work faster, you can use article AI generator. Otherwise, you can just manually create them using Plot or ChatGPT. It's up to you guys. So I'm just quickly going to grab these two articles right here. I'm just going to leave everything as default, but I will be generating featured image so I can see how the post section exactly looks like. And since it's still in my local, I won't be able to auto post that. But when you upload that to your server, you can auto post that directly to your WordPress website just by adding the details right here of your WordPress. So you can follow the instruction here. And let me just quickly generate these two articles. And you can see right here, it's still going. So you just need to wait for a few minutes. It's been like three minutes now. I think uh, in the next two to three minutes, it will be completed. And you will see the progress right here. There are 14 tasks. Now we are on the sixth task. So let's wait for a few more minutes. 
Uh, so as you can see, it's still going, but I think it already completed all the required files. It's just creating a theme preview.html, which is not necessary. But anyway, let's go to the theme folder structure, and you'll see right here, these are all the files that we will need. And earlier, we also created a hero section image just to put in our theme folder to see how it's exactly if you look like. So I'm just going to download this. And here, let me drag that inside the assets folder right there. And let's see now if we will be able to activate the theme. So let's go to the WP admin. And here in the appearance themes, we should be able to see the theme here. And that's there, the vegan steak deep seek 3.1. Let's activate it. There's just this issue that I already asked Claude or DeepSeq 3.1 to fix. So I just simply copied that and pasted that again to VS Code right here. And it says it's already got fixed. Now let's refresh this. There you go. It's now the active theme. And let's open the website. Oh, look at this. This is the featured image that we created. As you can see, it's loading. And it has the parallax effect. We have the explore more. Wow, look at this. We have the mission, quality ingredients. This is really a stunning website right here. And it's all working. Look at that. Really beautiful. And we've got the latest articles right here. And let's go to view all posts. We have the hello world. Now it's time to add our sample articles to see how the post section look like. So let me add the article that we created here. And as you can see, they're all completed. Let's view the first article. So does vegan steak taste like real steak? That's the title of the article. We're going to copy it, paste it in the title section. And now save featured image. We're going to set the featured image right here and then copy the content. So just remove this duplicate image because it's being copied as well. So let's publish this and view the post. So this is the post section right here. It's pretty decent. It's looking really nice right here. You can see, and we have the beautiful footer section. And let's add the second article. I'm going to create a new post. And here, go to your articles and click this second article right here, the title, and paste it. Now we're going to copy the content. And here is the second article right there. So it really looks amazing. Let's go to the homepage again. And we have the professional looking homepage right here. And we have all the latest articles right there. And that's it. That's how you're going to create a latest WordPress modern design using the new DeepSeq 3.1. And it's really good. Thank you and see you in the next one.